Hello guys, this is Mike. I'm going to do a quick rundown of the old Palm Pilot TX. Well, actually it was a Palm TX. It was a pretty good hump, uh, Palm that came out to go against the Pocket PC. And uh, it had Bluetooth. You could surf the web. Um, you could even get Google Maps on it. I don't know if the Google Maps was uh, is still functional, but um, it won't hook up to my particular Wi-Fi, so I can't show you it surfing the web. But I found this thing to be very responsive. I thought I'd go through some of the things it had, some of the utilities. So let's check it out. Hold on. Okay. The, all right. It's going to try to hook to the Wi-Fi, but it won't. Uh, We'll see, we'll give it a shot. It's scanning. Continue to scan. Okay, it's very archaic by the day. It doesn't even see my Wi Fi. Alright. Anyway, we'll go away from that. I've already tried to hook it Wi Fi, it won't hook it on my particular computer so we'll go cancel anyway we'll close this particular application you have two ways of going to applications you can either open it the this way where you go through a window much like you would on the Android interesting thing about this particular Palm Pilot if you want to put new Say you want to write something new, you go, it doesn't automatically pop up the keyboard. Let's try it. Nope. If you want to use the keyboard, you need to find it. It does write. Okay, never, never mind. But anyway, it's very responsive. Like I was saying, this particular model was bought, uh, was made from 2005, if I didn't mention it, way, all the way to 2009. You were able to play your MP3s. Actually, it was got actually quite good. It, it sounded tinny, but it was actually very good as far as the time and what it could do compared to the Pocket PC. I wish I could get on the web and show you the web browser, but uh, this particular, this does not like my particular router right now, so I can't get it on there. But you can see it's quite responsive. And I wanted to show you, let's see, photos and video. The video actually wasn't bad for what it was, small screen. If I'm not mistaken, I think we've got a let's go back to applications. Go back to videos. I think we have a demo on here. It came with a demo. There we go. That's quite old. I don't know. Um, anyway, I think the video is quite short. Hold on. It's just a demo. I understand that we were able to put some video on here. I don't know what what you had to get get video on there, but it did do video. It did do web. It did office documents. And you did have an SD card. You put an SD card. I believe it was up to two gigabytes on it. You could send it to a printer if you have a Bluetooth printer, if you had a document. Anyway, I just wanted to share a bit of history with the Palm TX. Anyway, you have a good day. We'll see you later.